going on guys? Tobias Carter here again. I'm SuperTLC.com and with the recent events that's been going on in the media lately with the boycotts of the Oscars, what's going on in Flint and Detroit and just all around racial divide that's going on in America today. It made me think about a quote that I like. One of the, my favorite quotes is from Dr. Carter G. Wilson and it simply says this, if you can control what a man should think, you never have to concern yourself with what he would do. If you can make a man feel inferior, you never have to force him to seek an inferior status for he was seeking himself. And if you can make a man feel justly an outcast, you never have to force him to go to the back door. He'll go without being told. And I've been meditating on this quote for a few days now. And it just kind of dawned on me today. And I was just thinking about some things going through my Facebook timeline. And if you can make a, if you can determine what a man should think, you never have to concern yourself with what he would do. Let's think about that. Well, look what's going on in Detroit. Schools, our babies, elementary kids, first graders, they don't have books. Their schools are rotting and falling apart. Their mushrooms growing in the floor. The gyms are rotting. They're molded. There's pipes busted out in the playgrounds. They can't even go outside and play. They can't learn because they don't have any books. What's the future for these kids? Seriously, think about that. But if you go into the suburbs, West Bloomfield, they build a brand new schools, fireplaces in the middle of the school. But right up the street, 10 minutes away, the little elementary kids, first graders can't even have books. If you could determine what a man should think, that's, that's, they have no chance, no education. What schools... In Georgia, the teachers just had a, a cheating scandal. <laughs> black schools. The majority of black schools. He might have been on something. If you can make a man feel inferior, let's look at let's look at athletics. Oh man, we are hell in football, basketball, track. We're great athletes. Get paid millions of dollars to play sports. College and universities. We make up 3% of the enrollment, black men. But make up 50 to 60% of the football and basketball team. These teams bring in millions of dollars to the schools. But can we coach them? Can we coach at the Division I schools? Wait, in the pro level, athletes are getting paid millions. But can we, can we coach? Can we be the coach on the sideline? We have a few. Thomason, uh, old boy in Cincinnati. Oh, we damn sure can't own the team. Really? Own an NFL team? We might have, we, they let Michael Jordan have a basketball team. I think that's the only black owner. Hmm. Kind of inferior. But, Dr. Carl G. Wilson might have been on to something. Oh, if you can make a man feel just an outcast, you never have to force him to go to the back door. He'll go without being told. Oh, let's see. What, what's at the back door? What master got for us at the back door? Okay, master say, okay, we're going to take, we're going to take coons like Young Thug. All right, we're going to take you, right? We're going to make you a rapper. We're going to make you a performer. Might as well put on blackface the way he looks. Straight coon. Oh, we're going to pay you to talk about drugs. We're going to pay you to talk about guns. We're going to pay you to talk about liquor. So you can rap and you can shut and jive, right? You can shut and jive and tell our kids to drink purple Sprite. Go drink some codeine. Or oh, tell our kids that we ain't nothing but real niggas. That's all. We nigga, 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 nigga. Nigga, 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 nigga. Do that. We're going to pay this coon to tell our kids that. And listen to that all day. So what do they think? Oh, let me go drink some Hennessy. Gotta drink some Hennessy. I gotta go drink some Purple Sprite. I gotta go drink this liquor that he just getting paid for. Guess who that money going to back to them? They on the drug. They on the gun. They on the liquor. They on everything. Okay. Who else can we get at the back door? Oh, let's get Stacy Dash. Yeah, that's one we could get right there. That's a house nigga there. Yeah, she's pretty. She got a nice body. 
all oh, they love Stacy Dash. Let's put her on Fox, right? Let's put her on Fox so she can say the stuff that we can't say. Because if we say it, it's racist. But we could get her to be a coon and say it and say it to us. So it gotta it gotta resonate a little bit, cause it's Stacy Dash. We can call her stupid, we can call her dumb, we can call her Uncle Tom, but it's all in my timeline about Stacey Dash on Fox News. It resonates. It's a real constant reminder of what they think about us and really and truly what some of us even think about us. Hmm. What, who, what else is at the back door? This, what else can what made me think about the back door? Oh, I know what they can do. Let's take the son of one of the most powerful couples in America, Will and Jada Smith. Let's take them. Let's take their son. And let's make him not the face of Louis Vuitton men, because they know black people love Louis Vuitton. Oh, the first thing we do when we get some money, we got to go get some Louis Vuitton. Let's not make him the face of Louis Vuitton. Let's make him the face of Louis Vuitton women. Oh, we 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 made it now. We really? 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 We gonna take a young black man and make him the face of a luxury designer women's line and put him in a dress and put him on a couple of magazines and that's the representation of black men. Dr. Carter G. Woods might have been on the song. But I digress. I don't know. Just my thoughts I wanted to share. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. But I'm just making an observation, and I hope I made you think today. Again, Tobias Lopez Carter. I am a leader of leaders. Feel free to check out my blog. Hit me with some feedback. Let me know what you think. If I'm crazy, tell me I'm crazy. I love to hear it. But again, let's be great day, people. Take care. One dime. Cause I got a really big team And they need some really big rings They need some really nice things Better be coming with no strings Better be coming with no strings We need some really nice things We need some really big rings I got a really big team